Hello and welcome to another food review with me, John. Today, I'm at Popeye's in Louisiana Kitchen. And they, of course, have their new monthly different flavored chicken. Um, I haven't been there in a while to review, so they actually have two new ones that I haven't tasted yet. And I'm just doing really quick, back to back for you right now. I'm not sure which one's in the, each box, so I'm just open it up and tell you what I see. This is the Magnolia Chicken. Look at it. Doesn't it look like a flower? Like a magnolia? I don't know how they do it. It's like a little ball and little fingers, but it's supposed to look like a magnolia flower. Does it look like a flower to you? doesn't to me and you're supposed to use this with spicy orange sauce so I'm gonna taste it by itself and then taste it with the sauce let you know what I think about it so we're just gonna detach a petal smells all right It's got some spice to it, some crunch to it. You can see the chicken season on the inside of the breading. And let's try it with uh, some of this orange sauce. It smells very orangey. The sauce is pretty good. Uh, it does, uh, not that the spice was a whole lot to begin with, but it does like uh, dumb down the spice a little bit. So if you're someone who doesn't uh, care for too much spice, dip it in the sauce, it'll be all right. But overall, the chicken was good, the sauce was good. Nothing very special. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. It was good. Not great. The magnolia part of it I didn't understand because it didn't really look like a magnolia at all. Or any flower for that matter. But um, let me clean my glasses here for a second because I can't see out of this one. For... Probably touched my finger to it while I was eating the chicken. So the other thing we have is their Southern Fair Chicken Tenders. And this one, they give you a Mardi Gras mustard sauce for. So we're going to taste this by itself, and then with some of the sauce dipped in it. So I got three pieces here. I'm just going to tear one. I think this might just be breading. Mm hmm. Just ripped off some breading. My face from up. Mm, it's hot. Let me see some of this chicken. You can see this one doesn't really have any spice attached to the chicken itself. I'm going to taste it with some of this Mardi Gras sauce. I do like this Mardi Gras mustard sauce. It has a kick of horseradish in it. But um, as far as these uh, Southern Fair chicken tenders go, I like them. I like them better than the Magnolia chicken. I don't know if you see, but like, the breading for this one tastes and feels more like a cornmeal breading. 
And the other one was more like a batter. But the Southern Fair has sort of like a sweet flavor to the breading. The cornbread part of it makes it a little bit crunchier, I think, than it looks. And the sweet flavor in here contrasts very well with the, the horseradishy flavor I'm getting from the, the mustard. I like this one. I like it better than uh, the Magnolia one. I think they should have just called the Magnolia one just like orange flavored, spicy, or spicy orange chicken. Um, I don't really get the Magnolia part. The thing that tries to make it look like a flower just didn't make sense. But it did taste pretty good. It just was uh, uh, not didn't live up to its uh, its name. Anyway, I gave the Magnolia one an eight. The Southern Fair chicken tenders, I'm gonna give an eight and a half, just because I like those a little bit better. Still, not great. Definitely had better chicken before. Anyway, that's it for the review part of this video. But I did want to mention that I'm thinking about taking this these videos in a different direction uh, and taking my channel in a different direction. Not necessarily abandoning the food reviews. I'll probably do them still. Um, maybe just less often. Or once a week maybe. I just find it hard for me to put out more than one. Uh, these food reviews a week. Just because I end up eating a little bit uh, too much uh, fast food stuff. Um, not Like I said, not going to abandon it. Uh, just thinking about adding some more different content just uh haven't come up with the an idea yet probably some just um opinion pieces maybe on current events or pop culture things like that but anyway more information to come until then bye